yo. I say yo. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jeremy. It's coming at you guys with another video, man. First things first before this video even starts. In the middle of this gameplay, I want you guys to pay attention to how many layups they make my player miss. And then add that to the final score. That's all I gotta say about that. But if you are a new viewer to the channel, y'all know what to do. Leave a like on this video, especially if you support it. If you're not a supporter, go ahead and watch the video and don't leave a like. Sight no, leave a like, bro. That's the only way we're gonna get in the algorithm so my videos can pop up more on notifications when you hit that bell. And it can just pop up more in the algorithm so we can get more views, you know what I'm saying? Get more attraction to the channel and just grow the whole family, man. Grow the whole gang. But make sure you guys do all of that. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. And we're gonna get straight into this video. So today is like basically like me making it not really a statement, but me just telling y'all what's gonna happen over the course of this summer in terms of what I'm gonna be uploading. Now, y'all know anybody that's been keeping on my channel, um, I've done you know, I've been you know, I've done really it's been weird how I've uploaded. I can admit that. I started off, you know, with 2K18, and then Fortnite got super lit, so I tried to upload Fortnite. And then, you know, obviously, I've uploaded NBA videos, uh, things of that nature, vlogs, stuff like that. All those, all these different kinds of videos on this one channel. And um, from what I can see, usually with certain, most channels, if you stick to one thing, then, you know, you're able to grow a lot faster versus if you're switching up your content. It's kind of going to keep the viewers, you know, not really understanding what they're going to see next. And sometimes the viewers don't really like that, especially when you don't have a big, uh, like a big enough following. So I can understand that sometimes why my views have dropped when I stopped uploading 2K. But realistically speaking, right now, here right now, bro, I can tell you right now, I will be playing 2K20. Now, the reason why I say that is because um, it's pretty simple. 2K20 is just more playable than what uh, 21 current gen is and 21 next gen. So obviously, for those that do not know, on 21 current gen, basically the only way you're gonna win games is if you're a play shot creator or if you're a pain beast. That's the only way you you know you'll win games effectively. Um if you play twos especially, you're not going to win a game unless you have a play shot creator and a paint beast or you just end up playing some bums, but 10 9 times out of 10 when you're playing twos, you're going to face sweats and then even with um you know even with threes, you know people might people might have zens, you know all these things might be going on with current gen, so that's pretty much well, that's one layup right there that we miss. But um yeah, Y'all know how it is on current gen, bro. Once I, I quit playing current gen while, you know, while I was still on it. So it's not like I quit current gen after I got next gen, obviously. I actually quit it before I even got next gen, before I even knew I, you know, that I had next gen on lock because of um how difficult it was to shoot and because of how bad the gameplay was. And then with next gen, you guys know the contact dunks were just out of control. Defensively, you can't get stops. You can't get steals. You can't contest anybody in the paint. Um, like I said, content dunks is out of con out of control. You can damn near shoot from half court. That I don't think that is too much of a problem because you can stop that. And plus, the players, you know, if you're shooting from super super deep, you know, I'd rather see that than people just getting dragged into contact dunk animations because being able to shoot from deep is more is a lot more realistic, like on some Steph Curry or some Dame type ish, versus you know you know you just getting contact dunk every minute. And that's obviously the reason why everybody stopped playing. Um, you know, that's obviously the reason why everybody stopped playing next gen right away. Like before, you know, people could even really get their hands on it. Annoying TV was telling everybody how bad it was. And, um, for me personally, I knew I was going to end up getting it. So I was like, you know what, let me experience it myself and everything that they were saying were just correct. So, you know, just in terms of the variety of players you can use on 2k20, it just makes the game more fun to play. Is the gameplay perfect? No, never said it was perfect. You know, definitely it is not perfect. Obviously, you guys can see how overpowered Intimidator was. Rim Protector, like he made me miss a wide open layup. He was nowhere near me. And that's, you know, like I said, keep track of how many layups they make me miss. But um, that was an issue with 2K20. The hop steps were an issue. Um, slightly early is going in, slightly late is going in, too much at a high rate. That was an issue. But if the gameplay wasn't, there was nothing game breaking. You know what I'm saying? Like there was nothing game breaking. I would say that the post scores are game breaking almost every year, but yeah, definitely in 2K20 they were game breaking. You could say, but that's that was really about it. Nothing too crazy, but there were so many different builds. There was so many different like there's like 100%. You could name at least five to ten, anywhere in that range of five to ten builds 
that are comp that you can literally streak with all day whether you're playing 1v1 2v2 threes right there's so many builds on 2k20 you can use so i think for this remainder of the summer i'm gonna keep playing 2k20 obviously if you guys didn't see i did stream 2k20 last night and it's probably the most traction i had on the stream in 2k in a minute like every time i play 2k21 or you know i didn't i haven't streamed it that much at all this year probably like i would say no more than 10 times i've streamed 2k21 it's just been that terrible and that boring to play um so yeah but i was streamed 2k20 and it was lit bro people was pulling up we had like an average of like 10 viewers the whole stream you know what i'm saying which is good for me if you guys know because i don't like i'm not a streamer so i'm not streaming 24 7 to where i can build up that you know that loyal stream base like how people do um which i you know which is what i want to do but i can't force myself and i will not force myself to play a game that i'm not enjoying so if i'm not enjoying 2k you can best believe that i will not be streaming it so yeah with that being said y'all see what it is man this is what i'm gonna be playing on the 1v1 stage if i find people to play with that are actually gonna you know help me win games then i'll play with them so if anybody here still play 2k20 or is down to download it and play let me know and i'll run it up with you bro but this is what it's gonna be for the remainder of the summer i had a lot of fun i'm talking about five hours guys i streamed five hours of 2k20 simply just playing the stage i wasn't even playing with anyone with anybody so i can only imagine if i'm getting in the wreck or if i'm playing um twos threes like you know that's gonna be a lot of fun so that says a lot about 2k obviously 2k20 is not gonna be around for a while um or you know by the end of this year it, it will be gone you know what i'm saying because you know what 2k does they shut off the servers every two years because they just want to be greedy they want everybody to buy the newest game instead of you know because some people would just stay on the older ones that they have the most fun on but um it is what it is man 2k is real slimy but yeah i'm hoping for actually no never mind i'm gonna keep it a stack with y'all y'all should y'all expectations for 2k22 should be low 2k has not listened to us for the past what four years so Keep your expectations low. You guys, like I said before earlier in the video, keep pay attention to how many layers and maybe miss. I beat this guy. You know what I'm saying? That's just how 2K rocks sometimes, man. They're, they're just going to really bail you, bail somebody out and give them a win. But y'all know what it is, man. I will be streaming 2K20. Leave a like on this video if y'all are getting, you know, if y'all think you're going to enjoy 2K20. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. And like I said, guys, do not have any hope for 2K22. It is what it is. It's your boy, Jerry Ranks. And I'm out, y'all. Peace. Gang. They cannot do it like him. Uh, uh huh. Nobody shooting like him. Gang. Nobody doing like him. That nigga hate everyone cause he broke. And that's why I'm fighting like him. Gang. SD Glow, now he talking this shit.